let's see what the KFC chicken does to my glucose level. So I've bought exactly two big pieces. It's a roughly normal portion. In there we can estimate there are about 20 grams of fat. There is also quite a bit of sodium. So chicken in theory is an excellent source of protein but frying is very high in sodium and also in carbohydrates, so that can pose a little problem. So I'm very curious to see if ultimately the fat from the frying is, the proteins will balance the fact that there are still quite a few carbohydrates in the breading around the chicken. Okay, so it's been two hours since I ate the KFC chicken, and we're going to check on the glucometer right here to see a little bit of what happened. Wow, so on the graph there, we see exactly the impact it had on my blood sugar every five minutes. And actually it had very little impact since we see that it raised my blood sugar about 30 milligrams, which is really very, very little. So it means that the fats and proteins in that chicken largely balanced the breadcrumbs on the chicken. So purely from a blood sugar level perspective, um, the KFC has no negative impact. It's even rather good for health then. I'll let you say in the comments why it might not necessarily be good for health. I know that many people criticize KFC. Remember that results can be different from one person to another. If you test the foods, you might have a different reaction. So always pay attention to your own body.